Hey guys, Ben here and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing a video on The Flash Season 5 and we're going to be breaking down the trailer for Episode 17 so if you do go on to enjoy the video please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Okay, so this episode is titled Time Bomb and this is one of my most anticipated episodes for sure because this is the episode where we're getting a massive, massive reveal that I'm just going to tease. I'm sure most of you guys know it already, but we're going to be talking about that later in this video. And it's very, very exciting what we have to talk about because this trailer is really exciting. And if you realize recently why I haven't been including some of the trailers, it's just that I really do have a tough time with the copyright people behind Warner Brothers. They have like this botter system that just, you know, really screws me over and I get demonetized. So that's why you don't see the trailers very often recently. But check them out on the CW's channel or TV Promos DB. They always upload them. So I'm sure most of you guys have seen it by now if you're watching this video anyway. So. Recently I did that synopsis breakdown for the episode, so just going to quickly read it out to give us some, you know, backstory and information for this episode as to what's going on, but here is how it goes. Nora decides to tell Barry and Iris the truth about Thorn. Team Flash finds out that a suburban mum named Vicky Bolan is in danger and they race to save her. Upon meeting her, they discover she's a metahuman who is hiding her abilities from her family. Barry encourages Vicky to share her secret with her family, which makes Nora realize she has to come clean about, to come clean with her parents about Thorn, sorry. All right, so that is the synopsis, and so that's just a bit of context. We're not gonna break that down. I did that in another video, but now we're going to lead on to the trailer and what it says and what we can see in the shot. So. The first shot of the trailer is in the forest, and again, we've seen this forest many times. It's near Central City, obviously shot in Vancouver in real life, and we see one of the time ships, and so I think this might be just me having to go back and correct myself from my review because I talked about how maybe a speedster brought her back, but I believe that future Cicada, who is Grace, has actually time-traveled back in time using this device and so they find it in the forest and, you know, Team Flash is all there. So Nora, Barry, Sherlock and Cisco's there. And I'm guessing maybe Caitlin's quite close behind and maybe Iris. But they find this device and this is probably them finding out, oh shit, you know, why is this version of Cicada here? How the hell is she here? And they don't know it's Grace at the moment, but maybe they're able to find out that it's a woman and they can trace it to actually Grace and perhaps the future. And they find perhaps, you know, a device or this device nearby, maybe on their radar or something. I have no idea how they're going to find out. But anyway, that teases the idea of how Grace has actually come back into the past because this version is definitely a future version of her. And so then we move on and we see this shot with Sherlock and he's sitting in a wheelchair and I believe this is Thorne's wheelchair from the past and so I reckon in this scene he's sort of getting into the mind of Thorne after the reveal which we'll talk about in a minute but you see him in the wheelchair as he's in Star Labs you, you can see the logos around and he's testing out this wheelchair and so definitely definitely doing his detective work so moving on to the next shot we see Barry and Barry says secrets are like walls you can't really know someone with walls between you and this relates to what's going to be revealed so we see Nora in this shot it's a really really nice really well lit shot and you see Barry and Nora as they're talking together and it seems like perhaps this is like later in the episode after the big reveal which we'll talk about in a sec but you see Barry and he looks very sort of unhappy and so we move on to the next shot and Barry's in his flash suit and he looks, you know, he's in action obviously and he looks like maybe he's been punched or maybe he's been knocked back and he's kind of shocked in some way. But then we move to 2049, we see the timer in the prison and it seems to be going quite fast. So yeah, they don't have much 
longer to go and we know as they teased at the end of last episode something is coming or someone and by the way when Nora time travels to 2049 she literally comes like you know a minute after or something after she's left so that's why the time has gone on for so long and that's why this thing whoever's trying to get in is still here so again it could be future cicada but she's in the past so that doesn't really make sense unless she's here and maybe she's from a different part of the timeline maybe she's you know time travel from further in the future but it still I still stand by my stance that it could be Godspeed because they describe it as like a thing or like it could be human we're not sure about that but yeah so we know Godspeed's coming in episode 18 but it says on the timer only 12 minutes left so he does not have long and so we see this shot of reverse flash and again he looks very very distorted and I think that's to the filmmakers credit but Nora says this should all be over and then reverse flash after that says it's too late and then Nora says what do we do now and then he says tell your father tell your father everything oh my god so this is the massive reveal is going to be happening in this episode reverse flash is going to be officially revealed to be working with Nora to team flash and we'll talk about the shots in a sec but you see like I said this shot of reverse flash he looks very disorientated and they are desperate and I have to emphasize that they are 100% desperate otherwise they would not tell Barry or anyone and so we see Nora as she's utterly panicking look at that you should see it in action if you have watched the trailer which I recommend you do she is sort of just freaking out like hard and so she's like what do we do now what do we do so you know desperate need for help from Thorn and Thorn doesn't know what to do apart from tell your father tell your father everything and so we move on to the next shot it looks like it's in some sort of nursery which is kind of weird but we see this grace version of cicada from the future and she's got her dagger and it looks like maybe she's thrown it and she stabbed someone but we move on and we see barry as he sort of flicks his head around as you'll see in the trailer in action and i don't know i'm guessing he's fighting grace's cicada but then like i said this is the bit where Nora reveals and we get the reaction from Barry as to, you know, finding out about Nora working with Reverse Flash. So we see this shot of Nora as she looks utterly sort of scared and just like, oh, just drop pan dead because of Barry's reaction. And we cut to Barry and there is tears in his eyes and oh my god, then he tilts his head and he's sort of got this face of confusion and sorrow at the same time and oh my god I can't wait for this bit in the episode because you know it's going to be such a massive revelation and such a big shock that I don't know if Nora's going to be safe like Barry's going to be like holy shit how is this my daughter or anything so yeah I, I have no idea what's going to happen but I'm utterly intrigued and so like I said the trailer really doesn't sort of tease a lot of what happens in the synopsis because the synopsis focuses more on the Vicky Bolan suburban mum type part of the story so you know they help her and it seems like Grace's cicadas probably are after Vicky Bolan because she's a meta and so maybe Grace is like finishing what cicada started and she does that in the future and so on. So she comes back for this one specific person, but then, you know, in the synopsis it teases that massive reveal and we get that in the trailer, which is very, very, very exciting. But then remember, episode 18, we have Godspeed, so what? Imagine if Godspeed actually appears, like, right at the end of the episode. That would be the best reveal if he is the thing breaking in, and we know... Barry is going to go to the future with Nora in 2049 as we've seen from set photos that have been leaked and he's going to be there and they're working together still so it's not going to be like the worst thing but I think his reaction he's going to you know be totally mistrusting and feel utterly betrayed but they will still work together because they are father and daughter and you know they are a team after all so I think 
they will get through it, but it's going to take a while. And so in episode 18, when they go to the future, we know that they talk about this, about this massive reveal. And so then we see a different version of Nora actually fighting Godspeed. So I'm so intrigued to see Godspeed, but mainly for this episode actually as well, because again, I want to see the reaction of Barry as he finds out and also the time travel stuff to do with cicada well grace's cicada so thank you guys so much for watching if you did enjoy this video please be sure to leave a like and a comment subscribe if you're new and turn on notifications to not miss any videos and i will see you guys later goodbye